today is Tuesday the 9th. Yep, Tuesday the 9th of May and I am just popping in to say hello. I didn't film anything yesterday on Monday because I filmed a couple of things on Sunday and yesterday I just spent the day working at my desk so I didn't have anything to film for you guys. Um, Tuesday today is going to be much of the same as yesterday only today I'm thinking I might make uh, Tuesdays a new filming day for the, my more kind of like chatty sit down videos where I, that I'm wanting to post on Wednesdays I think because these vlogs are going to go up on Sunday which is my normal upload time but I want to increase my um, weekly video count to two videos and so Sunday I want to be vlogs and Wednesdays more sit down chit chat videos. Let me know what you guys think about that idea in the comments below or if you have a better suggestion but I think that's what I'm going to start doing so Tomorrow is Wednesday, I have my videos, they always go up at 8am GMT and so I have got to film a video today. So I think that's what I'm going to do and I am currently just about to sit down and have my breakfast, you know, the usual porridge and some golden tea. I just crave it every day, that's what I have every day. Um, uh, probably won't show you my porridge every single day, but that's that's what I have. Slight variations on the fruit and the toppings, but um, yeah, and I will check in with you guys later. Bye! So I have just finished filming Wednesday's video for you guys. Um, it's a tour of my kitchen and specifically the zero waste items in my kitchen. I'm out of breath because I've just come all the way upstairs. <sighs> so that will be up. Wednesday, which is tomorrow. So I'm just going to sit down and edit it, edit that now along with this vlog. And I'll link that here if you haven't seen it already. Go and check it out and let me know what you think. Because I'm thinking of making it into a series, like a mini series. So I'm just going to go and sit down and edit that now and get that scheduled for tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. And I've just got a little snack here. It's not the prettiest snack, but it is one of my favorites. It's just some apple slices, raisins. Um, with some cinnamon over it and I'm just going to dip it in some almond butter. So that's what I'm going to do for the rest of this afternoon probably. It's almost four o'clock. So I will see you guys in a bit. And for you guys who can't get enough of Winnie, she is joining me here in the living room and she's looking as beautiful as ever. Say hello. So I am just about to hit schedule on tomorrow's video. I am so excited to be uploading twice a week now. I think, I mean, it's a lot harder because I'm gonna have to take a lot more time filming and I'm already filming every day for the vlog, but I've really been loving it way more than I thought I would. So I'm just about to schedule this video. It's gonna go live tomorrow and I'm so excited. It's so exciting. Okay. So it is Wednesday morning and you guessed it, I am sitting down to another bowl of porridge. <laughs> and Winnie's here. <laughs> That's all these vlogs are going to be, just porridge and my cat. Um, I'll see you guys in a bit. I am just in my kitchen having a look to see what I could have for lunch today. Um, and yesterday I was in the kitchen filming a zero waste tour in here, so if you haven't seen that already, I'll link that up here um, and have a look. And I kind of like this like vlogging, since I've been vlogging my week, um, I kind of like that kind of style of video. So it's more of like a vlog style tour of my kitchen, showing you guys around some of my zero waste items. Um, and I have been thinking about doing it in like every room of the house. I'll do my office, the bedroom, the living room, the bathroom. Um, and so far, I've had some comments saying that you guys would like that. So I think that's what I'm going to do. And um, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to have for lunch because I'm kind of running out of stuff. Thankfully, I'm going out for dinner tonight, so I won't have to think about what to have for dinner. But yeah, I don't know. We'll see. So I have found some mushrooms and some leftover salad as well. So I think what I'm gonna do is put these together and make just like a quick pasta thing for lunch because I have got quite a bit of work to get on with today. So that'd be a nice, easy, quick lunch. It's so great to make like 
bulk of something and then just like have leftovers like the salad that I made on the weekend um, just to nibble on through the week it makes lunches so much easier um, so I think that's what I'm gonna have and then crack on <laughs> because it's completely covered in nutritional yeast um, I'm gonna sit and eat this and watch YouTube videos because one I don't own a television and two I don't really like what's on television I really like to watch YouTube videos and so that's what I'm gonna do so it's half one and I'm feeling like I'd like a little bit of a snack but I've got a little bit of a sweet tooth going on as well so I'm just gonna snack on a banana with a little bit of almond butter to dip it into. It doesn't look amazing, but there is something about this combination that is just so good. <sighs> Hi guys, it is now five o'clock on the dot in the evening and I had plans to go out tonight for dinner in Soho at Mildred's, a great veggie vegan restaurant, but I'm really not feeling up for it. So I've had to cancel plans with my friend, which I absolutely hate doing. Um, but I'm really not down to do that this evening. So instead, I've got a few blog posts that I need to write up for May. So I think I'm going to have a crack at that this evening. Um, I've just had a shower and got into some comfies. I've got <laughs> my David Bowie t-shirt on here, my pyjama shirt. And so I think I'm just going to have a chill one, get a blanket on the sofa, um, try and write up some of these blog posts, and call it an early night. So um, I will see you guys in tomorrow's vlog when hopefully I feel a little bit better. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. So I just came out to the garden to water the plants here behind me and I realized that it's such a lovely evening. The sun is shining. Most of the time the sun doesn't come to the garden, um, but in the evening we get like 20 minutes of bright sunshine. So what better to make me feel better than the sun up here. It's just peeping through. So I'm gonna spend the next half an hour or so or until the sun goes out um, blog post writing in the sunshine. The neighbor's cat has decided to come and join me. She basically lives in our garden. This is her. She's basically, <laughs> she's basically the opposite of Winnie, my cat. She's super chatty and super friendly. And she's always here for a cuddle.
just made some oil free hummus. It's not fat free because it does have tahini in it, but it's lower fat because it's oil free. Um, and chopped up some veg and a bit of pita bread. And I'm gonna dig in. I think this is gonna be my lunch. I was planning on making a snack, but it's quite big. So I think this will be my lunch for today. So I've got the hummus topped with some paprika, some pita bread, carrots, peppers, and um, oh, I always forget what these are called. And some radishes just because um, I love them. Also, yeah, it's amazing that makes me think I could so easily be a raw vegan other than this. But obviously this is like a secondary thought, I don't even need that. Um, I could easily do raw vegan, I would love to try it. Yeah. I would love to be raw vegan for um, a month or so just to try it out. Obviously I live in England and so it's a little bit more tricky, that might just be an excuse, but I do feel like it's a lot more tricky because it's cold here a lot of the time and warm food is very warming and hearty and we don't actually have a lot of um, like locally grown fruits and vegetables, but I would love to try it in the summer months. I think I'm going to do it for a month. Um, let me know if you guys would want me to do that on YouTube and do it so you guys can come and do it with me and I can share the foods and recipes that I'll um, be making because I think that might be fun. So let me know in the comments below if you'd like to try raw vegan for 30 days with me. it is Friday and I realized that I forgot to wrap up yesterday's vlog so what happened was I went back to Norman's Coach and Horses in Soho like I did last week if you saw last week's vlog and I had fish and chips again uh, but this time with a bunch of friends and friends of friends um, and oh sorry oh I've only just woken up um, so yeah, and then I got back uh, home around midnight and I just had a shower and went to bed so there was nothing to film really. Um, and today I am... Oh my god, I can't stop. <sighs> Look at how adorable Winnie looks. All stretched out. Good morning. And so today I am... Um, writing some more blog posts for May and scheduling and taking photographs and what else editing the vlog um, and then this goes up on Sunday and um, I think then I've just got like bits and bobs and chores to do and I'm gonna get some food because I ran out of food like you saw yesterday um, and just like bits and bobs around the house I might film um, bits here and there but if I don't then I will say goodbye to you now okay i'll see you guys in the next video bye